Hey YouTube, Nezzy Nez123 here with another review. Uh, now here I have the Spawn uh, Graveyard Playset. Um, now these are from the Spawn Playsets that came out back in 97. Um, out of the three playsets that came out, this one is my second favorite. Um, just due to the fact that it brings the clown figure and you know that figure is pretty detailed. And, and you know, I, like, I really like that graveyard piece also. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Now here we have uh, Mr. Al Simmons, Mr. Crispy himself. Um, when he's about to transform into Spawn, I think, for the first time. Um, and he has kind of like that, that Wanda, Wanda, that Wanda face going on there. Uh, it looks like a like a symbiote is wrapping around him. Like is he about like if he's about to transform into Venom or some shit. Um, pretty cool detail on this guy. You know, you look at he look at his face too. He even has some of the detail going on there for the for the face mask. Uh, pretty cool figure. I like it. Um, then you have here the accessories that come with it. You have a shovel, a shovel with a with a face. Uh, with the violator, where the fuck is it? Where the fuck is the camera thing? What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> um, you have a shovel here with the with the uh, clown's face on it. Uh, you have the the Lieutenant Colonel Al Simmons uh, tombstone. Well, part of the tombstone, you know, it sits on there. Um, you have a dagger that comes with this guy. Uh, either Spawn or the Clown can hold it. You have this uh, skull here, dead animal carcass, and then you have the highlight of this of this set for me, which is the the Clown figure itself. Pretty detailed, and the the hair is made out of soft goods. Um, I really like this guy. I really like it a lot. Uh, now, now like the the final battle playset, which I didn't like that much because of the, you know, just, I don't know, it just didn't do it for me. This one has an action feature that, that does work. Um, you press down on the tombstone here, and it reveals this body. Um, or this corpse, whatever. Now, you could probably display this, uh, this guy here, you know, crawling out, or you know something like that or whatever whatever your your imagination uh, comes up with you could probably you know probably do I mean nothing with articulation though because obviously the articulation on these on these figures are very limited uh, but yeah you can not, you mess around with your imagination come up with something you know I already did I, I think I had them I think I had them uh, laying down, but then again, I had trouble with the face. I don't know. I mean, just a little tampering with it. You'd probably do something. Um, I really like this set. I really do. Like I said, it's my second favorite out of the three. The alley playset being the first out of the three. Again, the highlight of this one, to me, is the clown figure. That guy is pretty spot on. So, we got three spawn figures so far. We have uh, Mr. Crispy over there. We have the one from the alley playset and the spike spawn. Um, so, that's pretty cool. I wish it would have come out with one more. Like, maybe uh, maybe that scene where he dropped, out from the, dropped down from the ceiling and his cape, you know, his cape was everywhere. That would have been cool if they would have put... They would have made a, like a little diorama out of that. It probably would have been a lot bigger than these, but that would have been something I really wanted to see. Um, I really wanted to see a figure with him with his cape. Uh, his cape is basically a character on its own in the movie because it, it does whatever the you know it does whatever the fuck it wants. Um, so they should have. I think they should most definitely made one, or maybe him perched on on the church or some shit and the cape flowing in the wind you know that classic spawn pose 
Uh, that would have been really nice, but I am content with what we were giving here. Um, I'm not, you know, I'm not too picky. Well, not that picky anyway. <laughs> I'm just really content with this damn clown figure. I really like it a lot. And even the crispy over there, um, I really like him. I would say if you were gonna, if you're a fan of the movie, and you want to get these guys, go ahead. I mean, it's these these guys go for cheap anyways on online. So yeah, I, I would recommend it most definitely. Um, yeah, man, I nostalgia purposes only. That's it. And that's the only reason I got them. Um, well, yeah, this has been a review of the Spawn Graveyard place set. Uh, consider picking this guy up if you're a fan of the clown or Crispy or you just want that little diorama piece. Yeah, go ahead on Amazon and get it. They're pretty cheap. All right, this is Nezinez 123 and I'm out. Now, here's a quick look of all the play sets together. And here you have the graveyard one, the clown. Crispy over here. Mm -hmm. And you have the final battle. There you go. I don't have all the accessories laid out with them. I just, you know, I just wanted to give you a quick look at what all three of them look like. Yeah, the alley place hat there, which is my favorite one. It's pretty cool. Yeah, cool little display pieces, if anything, you know. I think that's what they were meant for, but yeah, cool nonetheless. I like them a lot. Oh, yeah, that was just a quick little look at all three of them.